Hi, my name is Cecily, um, and I'm a junior from Gretna High School. Childhood tastes like sickly sweet honey canned by my grandma, smells like the earth beginning to thaw and dirt being scooped in handfuls, feels like the sweaters of wool that are lost and replaced with the shorts from the back of my closet. My parents' sanity is no longer intact. They've lost it because as kids, we can't control our excitement is prodded at, like cattle by the summer air, it's intoxicating. As kids, we learn to love the ice cream truck bells and the late night firefly hunts, diving through bushes of thorns and swooping under porch banisters and swing chairs like it's a stunt. These fireflies were hunted down like shadows from the sun. Steakhouse hosted by the neighbors, never without a one sauce or the neighbor lady's newest concoction of big kid drinks. As kids, we learn to never cross the street without looking twice, left, one, two, three, right, one, two, three, run across the road. My friends and I used to go hunting for toads in the creek behind our houses. We would spend day and night fighting through weeds, debris, and bugs as if it were treasure at our feet. As kids, we learned to latch on to our parents. Every day spent telling them how our day was and what we learned in school, I used to tell my mom all the made-up things my friends and I did. And she used to listen intently as if there was nothing more important to hear in the world. My mom was my world as my kid, and I don't see it changing anytime soon. As kids, we learn to put our trust in our moms and dads. We rely on them to be our fallback, giving in to being fussed over. But as we get older, things start to change, and we're told we must become independent. And if we aren't ready to be, we are labeled as dependent. Growing up isn't something I'm ready for. Growing up isn't something I'll ever be ready for. College loans, tax returns, taxes. I think I maxed out my math skills in Mr. Garter's algebra class. I'm not ready to grow up, but I'm too fr prideful to ask, is it okay if I don't, just for a while more? I want to be a kid again, a kid in summer where the only concern was getting home before the street lights turned out, washing my feet in the sink before getting into bed, waking up before mom so I could have the TV, living life as simply as it could be lived. Because most days it's too hard to grow up and ask, is it okay if I don't, just for a while more. So on the days when I can't stop overthinking but know I need to, I'll look to my mom for laughter because She's my laughter, she's my comedic relief, she's my Tinkerbell jingle, she's my mom. Because some days it's too hard to grow up and ask, is it okay if I don't just for a while more? So on the nights when I don't feel like asking, but no, I need to, I'll sleep beside my mom. Like I did as a little kid in summer, because she's my fallback, she's my must-have, she's my sidekick, she's my mom. And there's so many things I wish I could tell her, wish I could do for her like she did for me, but I'm bad at talking. But I'm great at writing, so mom, this is my thanks to you for being everything I've ever needed without a single complaint, because that's just what moms do. I just want you to know I'm so glad that the mom I got was you.